بسم الله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى عليه وصحبه وسلم أما بعد حبت في الله You should never be bored and wondering what you can do with your time As we're human, we all have shortcomings, we all have faults And the Prophet عليه الصلاة والسلام said كل ابن آدم خطأ وخير خطأين توابون All the children of Adam uh, make sins And the best of those who sin are those who repent to Allah سبحانه وتعالى so, with our human frailties, of course we forget, and of course we become bored at times. But the mu'min is ever vigilant in using his or her time in order to please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ala aqal, meaning in even that's the least they can do, is remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Listen to this athar of the salaf. عن إبراهيم بن أدهم قال أعلى درجات أن يكون ذكر الله عندك أهلا من العسل and this was in استنشاق نسيم الأنس لابن رجب رحمة العيد رحمة واسعة إبراهيم بن أدهم رحم الله تعالى he said the greatest level is that one that one can attain is when one remembers Allah and by remembering Allah it is more delicious to you than honey this shows us how the salaf were with regards to remembering Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that they didn't busy themselves with kathra taqil wa qal by busying themselves by talking about this one indulging in this one talking about things which have no benefit and don't bring you any closer to Allah, nor do, they don't benefit you in this life as well as the after, but rather they sought that asal in the dunya, that honey in the dunya, which was, and that which was sweeter than the honey, and that was remembering Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and we ask Allah the Almighty to bless us with ilm al-nafi, ruskan tayyibu, amal al-muttaqabil, and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us to be of the dhakirin wa dhakirat, wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad,